On January 24, 2006, Jennifer Joyce Kessy, a 24-year-old finance manager, vanished under mysterious circumstances. Her disappearance has remained a baffling and a heartbreaking case that has amassed significant attention over the years. Jennifer was living in a condominium complex called the Mosaic at Millennia in Orlando, Florida at the time of her disappearance. On the morning she went missing, she failed to show up for work, which immediately raised concern among her family, friends, and co-workers. Her family then contacted law enforcement and an investigation into her disappearance would be set in motion. One of the key pieces of evidence in Jennifer's case came a day later when her black Chevy Malibu was found in a complex called the Huntington on the Green Condominiums, which was about a mile from where Jennifer's condo was at the time. The car's location raised questions as to what happened to Jennifer and why her car was left there. Notably, at the time, there were no signs of a struggle or immediate evidence of foul play in or around her vehicle. There is video surveillance footage capturing someone parking Jennifer's car and abandoning it, but due to the video quality and the angle of this footage, that person has never been identified. Law enforcement agencies, including the Orlando Police Department, have conducted searches, interviewed witnesses, and followed various leads, but unfortunately, no substantial breakthroughs were ever really made in this case. Over the past 17 years, the Kessie family has tirelessly sought answers and justice for Jennifer. They have actively advocated for her case by appearing on television shows, utilizing social media platforms, and working closely with law enforcement agencies. Their efforts have aimed to keep Jennifer's story in the public eye, hoping that someone with vital information will finally come forward. But so far, this has not happened. Despite the passage of time, Jennifer Kessie's case remains open and unsolved. The lack of progress has been frustrating for her family, even to the point that they now have taken the lead from law enforcement in Jennifer's case. However, they do continue to hold on to hope that one day the truth will be uncovered and Jennifer will be found. Numerous theories and speculations have emerged over the years regarding what might have happened to Jennifer. Some suggest that she may have been a victim of a random act of violence, while others believe that she may have known her abductor. The circumstances surrounding her disappearance have led to widespread speculation and public interest, but definitive answers have remained difficult to track down. Though it has been difficult, the Kessie family continues to push forward for answers, seeking justice for their daughter. They have even established the Jennifer Kessie Foundation, which aims to assist other families in similar situations and to advocate for improved policies and procedures in missing person cases. The case of Jennifer Kessie serves as a reminder of the countless missing individuals whose stories remain unsolved. It highlights the importance of ongoing efforts to raise awareness, provide support to families, and maintain pressure on law enforcement agencies to continue investigating unsolved cases. I am your host Drew V, and please join me soon on my newest episode of Drew Crime where I will cover Jennifer's mysterious story and really try to decipher through all the theories that surround this unsolved case. On January 24th, 